So today we are going to be unboxing this. This is a white sports, I think it's pronounced. Uh, it's the playing card, or not playing cards, it is collectible cards, trading cards. Uh, I have known about these for a long time and I've been very excited to try one of them. Uh, a lot of people tell me about them. I used to be big into Topps cards, especially Star Wars. So whenever I found out that they make a lot of anime ones, especially Love Live, uh, they make some. They made some Attack on Titan ones. They made a bunch of Love Live ones, and uh, then they made some quintessential quintuplets. And then the one that I picked up was the Licorice Recoil one. Uh, I am fairly optimistic that we'll get something because I did buy a whole box. Now this is not a huge box. You know, you can see here it's just a uh, kind of a standard box. But it is the Japanese version. I did not get the English version. The English version just came out, so I don't know where to get it yet. Uh, but this is the first box of these that I've ever gotten. So we're going to see what we get. Uh, I will go to a different angle so you can see the unboxings better. And then we'll come back here and we'll see what we get. So, yeah. Okay, so this is our box. We have a full box here. I don't know how many things are in this. I have not unboxed it yet. It is still... I took the plastic off of it, but it is still in its little box here. So let's go ahead and take that out. There we go. And we get something on top, so we get these two. They're neat. I like that one. That's some of that's some new artwork that I've not seen before, so cool there. I like this one a lot. So, let's unpackage some of these. I'm gonna cut them open and then I'll be back. So, cut to me doing that. Okay, so first pack here. I've adjusted the camera a little bit here, but let's see what we got. I did not cut it very well. Now, I have no clue. I'm trying not to damage these things. Uh, I have no clue what the rare ones are and what the not rare ones aren't but let's see so we have her a lot of these are screenshots from the anime but still very neat like that one that's cool okay so this is obviously like a hollow one what is this Okay, so the only one that actually caught my eye with that one is this one. Have no clue how rare that is. I don't think it is too rare. But any card. Okay, pack number two. I don't think we have got any repeats yet, which is good. That's a cute one. I like that one. It's another one of these, like, foil cards. That's neat. I do like how they do that. That's better than a lot of cards do, especially, like, tops and stuff. And this one. So you get one that's on its side. Don't know what that means, but... None have caught my eye yet, but we were just two packs in. There we go. Okay, so that is the Pantsu one. You can get him on a card. That's cool. Good pose there. I like that one. Okay. That one's neat. And there's that. That four... See, that's a level two. What's the Halloween one? I like that one. Another level two, though. Oh, cool. Okay, well, we're not at the end yet, so that's odd that we got a foil one that soon. Will we get something else cool here at the end? Nope. Well, it's a level two. And then when they're in the water... Uh, I'm going to sit this one to the side. Let's sit that one there. Pack five. I kind of destroyed that one. Oh, that's a nice one. 
great moment in the show. So I like that they made that into a card. Oh, we completed our Halloween set here. Oh, I like that one. That's a good card. I mean, I don't know if it's a good in like terms of like rarity, but it's one that I really like. Nice one. All right, here's our special one. Oh, a level three. And then whatever this is. So yeah. Once again, no clue. I'm going to consult with somebody after I do them all, and then I'll be able to tell you, oh, this one was rarer than I thought. All right, pack six. It's the rubber band incident. Okay, so we have got a double. I don't know if it's still level two or what on this one, but see, with tops, you would get different colors. So I guess the level is the color. I like that scene, so I like that. So maybe maybe we got some that is like really rare for that. Oh, I like that one. That's a cool one. Really nice one there. I think we have gotten, no, we got a different one. There's that one. So there's that. Give us something really cool here. Why the heck? That's level three, and it's 10,000. Don't know what that means. We're going to sit you right here. Or here. I'll do this. There we go. A lot of level zeros. All right, and this one should be our foil one. Doesn't look like it's nothing too terribly special there. We'll just go ahead and put that in that stack. All right, halfway done. We're at pack eight. And they're level two. Oh, it's another one of them. Oh, cool. It's a level three too, and it's like a special artwork. I like that one. That one's nice. We're going to put it up here. All right. That's a cool scene. Or it's not a cool scene. It's a funny scene. Ooh, I really like that one. Even though it is a more... This is a artwork that is pretty... It's shown off pretty much everywhere. Uh, it It is a really nice one. I like that one a lot. I don't know if there's a way to check on the card itself. Maybe not. All right, pack nine. Yeah, or no. Are we at pack nine or pack 10? I don't know. We've gotten a lot of this one. This is like our most seen card. This and these two. And we've seen this one a few times now. All right, so we got a foil mid thing. That looks different than the rest of them. I don't know if that one might be special. Let's set that one there. I don't think it is. I think we're just getting foil ones. We've seen this one already. Ooh, it's the Sakana. And it's bloody Shato. Uh, I like that one, even though it might not be anything because it's just level zero. That's cool. We're going to sit it over here. All right, pack, I think, 11. We've seen this one a few times now. We've seen that one a few times. Seen that one a few times. Same with that. Oh! Oh, nice! It's, it's, it's that, but in its actual card form. Cool! And it's a foil, and it's level three. Nice! We'll just put you right in front of that one. Cool! It was destiny for that one to be put there. And another one of these, but it's a really cool one. Ooh, what is this? It is that. So, or, yeah, there we go. Move that out of the way for you. It's that. So that's cool. Here, let's do this.
Close enough. Okay, so we have five left after this one, so this is pack 11. I don't think we've gotten that one so far. We're gonna make a new stack right here. I like that one. Very cute. All right, and for the foil, level zero, nothing crazy with that one. And bloody Takana. All right, pack 12. We're getting some that we haven't gotten, but we have gotten that one. Same with this one, we've got it before. Ooh, that's a nice one. Nothing crazy special there, but nice looking card. I do like the more, which, which like this one, this is a cute card, and I like that, but it, uh, it's a shot from the show, and so you're, you're split on whether you like this one better or this one better, and personally, I like cards like that better. All right, pack, I think, 12, another level three, but it is just a plain one, so... I don't think we've gotten this one. Same with this one. And now a foil. Ooh. Cool. Okay, so that one will go with... Put it over here. Obviously, these are probably not the rarest that they come. Because I have gotten two of them in one box. And I feel like that would be a bit much, but I am glad that I have both of them now. Oops, sorry. Nice one. And that. Alright, we have three left. Let's see if we get anything neat. There's another one from the Halloween set. We have both of them there even though we have both of them already. I like this one. This is a nice one. Very nice looking card there. It's a cool one. We've seen it before though. Another level zero foil. Don't think anything special from that pack. Okay, last, second to last pack here. Haven't seen anything super special in this one. I do see a foil towards the back. Whether it is anything special, we will see. That's a nice looking one. There's that. Yeah, it's a level two, so it's nothing crazy, but still cool. All right, and this is the last pack for this box. Another level three. I think we've already gotten this one as level three. Another one of these. We've gotten a ton of these. Here's another one of those like reverse foil type things. They look really neat, but I don't know anything about them. I really need to investigate this, but I wanted to open a pack blind. Okay, what, what does that mean? Well, those have it too. What does CX mean? Interesting. We will investigate. Ooh, it's a walnut level three. I think that's the highest, whatever this is, it's the highest level of it that we've gotten here. That's a nice card to end with here. I like that one. Okay, so I am going to investigate all of this and then I will return with my findings. Okay, so I've consulted with somebody that knows far more about all of this than I do, and he told me kind of all the secrets of these cards and what is something I need to look for, what is something that I don't need to look for. And basically it comes down to, and I will close up of this right now, there is a tiny little letter right here, and that will tell you what your rarity is. So what it basically is, is uh, you have R, 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 
a C for common, a U for uncommon, and then the more R's you have, the rarer it is. And then leading all the way up until, uh, spoiler alert, what we got, which is SR. So we'll get into that as we go. But I'm going to go through them all, and I'm going to show you kind of what we got. So I'm not going to show you any R's or anything like that, because we did get quite a few R's, so I'll give it that. We did get quite a few of them. Now, I don't know if they're worth anything, uh, but we'll, we'll, we'll see. So the first one here is our first RR. It is the Kurumi one here. That's a nice one. I did not put some of these. I put in uh, little con like cases, but most of them I did not, because I'm going to keep them, probably put them in a binder or something. But this is a cute little card. I like it. It is the hollow one here, so it's pretty nice. Uh, the value of this one is that. I don't I don't know at the moment, so maybe it's good. Maybe it's not. Uh, if it's over like a dollar, then I'm going to be pretty happy with that. But I would assume most of these are probably not. <laughs> but uh, then this one. This was actually one of my favorite cards that we got. Uh, this one... Is really nice. I just like the artwork of it. I like the look of it. This is another RR. Looks really nice. So pleased with that. Uh, another one I'm going to show off, but it is not a value. It is a PR card, which is the free one that we got whenever we bought the box. It came in the, the box. It is this one. I'll give you a close-up of it here. Looks really nice. I like this one a lot, even though it was, we didn't get any other ones like this. I, uh, I did look up some of them. And this one, I saw there was quite a bit of them from the mid card to where they would shift from the beginning of the episode to the end, or the second half of the episode, the commercial break thing. Uh, we didn't really get any of them. And I'm kind of disappointed, but this is one of them. But it is a PR card, so I don't think it's really worth anything. But still neat. Another RR card here is this one. Uh, I really like this one. It's just a cute little pose for her, and it looks really nice. As you can see, I did put them in these little protector things. No real reason. Only two of these I'll probably keep in protectors. These RR ones I'll probably take out because I'll save the protector for another time, but still neat. Now, probably I said that this one was my favorite card of the opening, but probably actually it would be these two. And it is these two, the uh, swimsuit look. I love these cards. And the reasoning why is because this is not a artwork that is officially released, as far as I know. So it is only available in this set. And I know there's a few other ones from this set that have the same thing. I'm curious if this is one of them that is only available here. But these are really nice. And I was excited to get... Uh, these two, whenever they came in the, they came for free, they were the PR things again, but I was excited whenever I saw these two, we got them, and I'm glad we got both of them, I would have been upset if we just got one or the other, but I'm glad we got both of them, I'm very happy with these, these I might find a way to actually display or something if I can. Now finally, we didn't get any RRR cards, we just got two SR cards, or yeah, SR cards, and they're these two. Uh, I don't know what the value of them are. I will put them here now. But they're neat. I, uh, they are the ones that I was saying had the different type of, uh, and I don't think you can see it through the uh, thing here, but they do have the different types of foil there. Pretty neat. I, uh, I am kind of... I don't want to say disappointed, because they do look nice. They look nice, especially this one. Uh, this one, I don't think really works with the foil as well as I would hope. Uh, this one, I think, turned out a little bit better. So, these are just uh, screenshots from the anime. So, while that's cool, I do like something like this that is, like, official, like, new art. Which you know, has its place, and I know that stuff like this has its place as well, but in terms of, like, cards that I really like, it's these. I know these would technically be considered rare and probably worth more. Maybe they're not. Maybe these are worth more. Uh, you'll know now, but I don't. So, yeah, uh, these is really the main things that I got 
for this box. Now this box I paid about 50 bucks for. I had some uh, Amazon credit, so I needed to spend that. I didn't need to, but I did. And so I bought a box of this. And really, I'm kind of split on if I want more. I probably would not buy another licorice recoil box. And no real reason for that. I just, I, I, this, whenever I looked through all the cards in the set, these were the two that I probably would have sought out. And I got them. So I don't really have a reason to do that. I know, like, uh, there's the Spy Family boxes, there's the Quintus quintessential quintuplets boxes there's love live there's the older attack on titan so there's a lot of different options that i could go with and i think i've kind of satisfied my hunger for licorice recoil with these two even though that i probably could get something better i know they have autograph cards which are probably super rare in all the time that i ever collected uh top star wars i never got a uh autograph card through them so my luck is not great whenever it comes to stuff like this, but I did have a lot of fun with this. Um, if this is something that interests you guys and it gets a lot of attention, maybe we'll do another one of these. Otherwise, this will I may do some shorts on this if I buy any more, like, single packs. So, look for that if you're interested. It probably won't be anytime soon because I'm kind of in a backlog of shorts right now. But, if you are interested in stuff like that, let me know. So anyway, that'll do it for today's video. It is kind of a different video. Normally, I do more of unboxing anime stuff or talking about anime. This is kind of a card video, which I know has its fans, but a lot of people don't like that. So if you didn't, and this wasn't your cup of tea, that's fine as well. Uh, but anyway, thank you for watching if you did, and I will see you guys next time. Don't forget to like and subscribe. That really helps me out, lets me know that you enjoyed it. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.